and just using grab command now first i will use caret special so i am typing grab minus capital e then caret then t as a pattern so this will test for all the line beginning with small t so here you can see it is matching those lines beginning with small t so now i take another example so here you can see it pinch the lines beginning with capital a so now so now i take one more try using this expression so here we are getting two lines beginning with capital t h now i will use ls command to display the list of the files and directories beginning with capital d so i am adding caret capital d so here you can see it displays the list of the files and directories beginning with capital d now i will use ls minus l command now i change little bit this so you can see here we get the tail list of the files and directories beginning with small d now i look into another answers that is dollar now i tap type tap minus capital e then expression s then dollar so this will display all the lines ending with s so here you will see it pins the line last line which ends with x which is matching from this file now i clear this screen i am typing cat file name so that we can view easily the matching pattern from this files now i will type ls then pipe then grep minus capital e then the expression s dollar which will display all the list of the files and directories ending with s so you can see it gives me all the files and directories ending with s now i again take ls minus l command then pipe then grep minus capital e then txt dollar this will print all the detail list of the files and directories ending with txt so here i got four files with txt and at the end now i left with one more enter that is backslash so i just type left minus capital e then c then backslash t this is used for escaping the next symbol this means it will search for those words in which ct is there in the matching so here you can see it is matching character in which the ct is there now i type uh, grep minus sorry ls command then pipe then grep minus capital e then the uh, accession capital d backslash o this will display all the files and directories with d o in between the matching so you can see we have two files with d with capital d o as a symbol in between the matching now i type ls minus l then grab 
no i should take uh, another example mm -hmm. so you can see it is matching gt in in between the pictures directly so now i use ls minus l command using this same expression so here we get the list of the files with ct symbol in between you can see it is matching ct symbol in between so now i use grab minus capital e so if i want to paint a blank line so i just type like this expression so so this will paint uh, nothing but a blank line so i have a blank line in this file so it is matching blank line here using this expression discuss about some useful grep option now i start with grep minus g option in this case it displays the number of time the letter pattern has been matched as you can see there are just two letter pattern in this file so it is counting two now next grep minus w option using this option we can select only those line containing matches that form whole word so here it displays the line containing is pattern only not this pattern which also contain is pattern now we go to the next option that is grab minus o this option display only the match string in a particular format now this will display file string three times in this format now to the next option is grab minus n in this case it displays the position of the line which contain the match chain so here you can see this string file is matching in second line sixth line and seventh line also now i go to further to the next option that is grab and back then backslash then smaller than sign this means it searches for the beginning of the word so here it search for the word which begins with the th string now if you want to find the words ending with th string now i will use this option backslash then wait then sign so you can see the word has been searched with and with th now we have option left with is grep minus v this option paint invert of the matches that is it matches only the lines that do not contain the th string you can see this th string does not contain in this two line that i have got in this output so let us try another example using this option so here you can see it paints the lines which does not contain t continue with some more grep option that is grep minus capital a capital b and capital c now i will first use grep minus capital a then number 
This option paints the additional content line after the matching. So here it will display two additional lines after the return change. Now let's change the number two to four. You can see after the return change it prints four more additional lines. This is first line, second, third and this is fourth. Now I will use ls command then pipe then grab minus capital A option with two more additional lines after the match. It, so here it displays the list of directories and the files starting with the small d here you can see it prints two additional files and directories after the demo file. Now I have another op grab option that I get minus capital B which will paint additional context line before the matches. So here it will display three more additional lines before the last change. One, this two, this is third line. Now I will make some slight changes to this number. You can see it prints five additional lines before the last change. This is fifth, fourth, third, second, first. Now I use ls manage l command to display the detailed list of the file and directory using this grep minus d option. So here we can see the files and directories ending with s has two additional files and directories before. You can see there are many more like this. Continue with one left grab option that is minus capital C. This option prints additional context lines before and after the matching. In this case, we have a matching character. Now it prints two lines before the character string as well as two lines after the character string. Now I will use ls minus l command then pipe then grep minus c2 and this expression. Now this, this will display all the list of directories and file ending with s. So here you can see it is ending with the s. Now you can see we have two files and directories before and after the particular matching expression. Now I change a little bit to this number. Now you can see it displays one more file and directory before and after the matching expression.